Also today, gagawa na tayo ng experiment about AC circuits, no? So, objective, ang objective natin will be to create a three-loop AC circuit system and measure each parameter, then verify it using our network theorem. So, okay, let's get started. So, we will be using this, no? Labeled constant or ACDC, no? 72688, no? So, makikita nyo, this will be our supply board, no? Meron siyang DC, pati AC. So, gagamitin natin yung mag-BAC. Ito po, no? So, up to 24 volts po yung pwede natin gamitin. And 1 amps, no? And yung load natin will be, no? Uh, ito lang, mga resistor lang. Yan po yung mga loads na gagamitin natin, no? Okay? So, yan po. So, para makonek natin yung circuit, no? We'll be using this jump, jumper connection, no? Four jumper lang to, no? And, okay, so, let's proceed, no? Okay, so, ito po yung circuit na gagawin natin. Okay, so, ngayon, let's make this circuit. So, first, connect muna natin si y 1K ohm resistor. Okay? Ayan. Next naman po is si 820 ohm resistor. Okay? So, ayan mo ito. Ayan mo ito. Okay. Next naman po is our uh, 5 5-10 ohm na resistor okay. Next will be our again 1K ohm resistor So, so, okay. so syempre Connect-connect na natin yung junction niya. Okay. okay. So, tapos. Next naman po is ito. Ito dito. So, ayan po, no? So, this will be our 3 mesh. So, yung supply po natin will be papunta dito. Ito. Line 1, line 2. Ayan. Tapos, 3 mesh. So, meron po tayong apat na resistor. Okay? So, supply natin siya. So, again, po tayo ng 12 volts. So, kung nandiyan siya dito, no? and yung ating ground, yung zero volt natin, is dito. So, kung pakansin nyo, ito yung supply natin. So, yung dito na lang. Okay. Supply natin. Kung supply nyo yung circuit na yun. So, 3 loop circuit po yan. So, on natin. Next, i-verify naman natin yung supply. No? Again, to do that, no? setting natin, voltmeter, and then dapat naka-easy siya. Okay? Next, measure natin. Verify lang natin. Huh? Ano? Voltage is 12.24 volts. Okay? Ngayon, I-measure natin isa-isa yung voltage across each parameter. So, umpisa natin sa 1K, no? So, sa 1K, this is 12.24 volts, no? Okay? Next, 820, hindi natin. So, the voltage across the 820 is... 8.68 volts, no? Then, the voltage dropped across here sa so ating 510. So, that is 3.56 volts. And the voltage dropped across dito sa so 1K sa gitna. This is 3.56 volts. Next naman po, i-measure naman natin yung mga current on each 
uh, parameters. So, nahin natin sa 1K, no? So, to that, di ba, setting natin, dapat naka-ameter, you know, ameter, then, AC. Tapos, syempre, nagaling natin to open natin, dapat lagi naka-series si DMM natin. So, ayan, the current flowing dito sa ating sa taas na resistor is 12.52 milliamps. Okay? So next Yung current flowing naman Sa ating uh, Dito Sa 510 uh, The current flowing sa ating 510 Is So this is 7.11 milliamps okay? 7.11 milliamps Next naman po is yung current flowing dito sa ating uh, 1K. So, to do that, kailangan natin siyang i-open, katulad kanina. So, tanggalin natin ito. Tanggalin natin ito. Tanggalin. So, tanggalin din natin ito. Yan. Tapos mag-jumper tayo. No? So, dapat connected pa rin yung ating supply. So, lagyan natin siya dito. Itong circuit na to is dito. So, trace natin, no? From the supply, pipe din, connected pa rin sa ating circuit. But, si 1K ohm, check natin, supply, open na siya. Ngayon, pwede natin yung measuring time niya. To do that, yan, ito lang natin. Dito to dito. Ayan. So, the current flowing dito sa ating 1K ohm resistor sa gitna is 3.63 mA. Okay. So, let's go ahead. And for our last parameter, yung current dito sa ating uh, 820 ohm na resistor. So, to do that, kailangan natin i-open. So, ilipat natin si supply. Lagi ko siya dito. Ito tanggalin natin. So, jumper natin to Dito. Tapos, makapansin nyo, that 820 ohm is open na. So, pwede nga rin siya series yung DIM natin. So, series lang natin. Ayan. Ayan. So, the current flowing, ayan o, oh, sa ating uh, 820 ohm resistor is 10.73 milliamps po. No? Okay? So, so, ayan, uh, measure natin na itong component ng ating circuit. So, now, you can verify it naman using our network theorems. No? Yun lang po, and see you again next experiment.